The annual Gene Upshaw Memorial Golf Classic has raised over $500,000 for local charities in the Tahoe Truckee community. One of the main reasons this golf tournament has been so successful since its inception five years ago is because of the person this tournament is named after. Gene Upshaw was family. He was like my brother, older brother, whatever. We didn't always agree on everything. Hey, I, I fought with him probably as much as a lot of you guys out there, but I loved him. and I could, It was okay for me to fight him, but not you. A two-time Super Bowl champion, Upshaw understood that there was more to life than the game of football. And after he died of pancreatic cancer in 2008, this golf tournament, in his name, has been one of the top charity events in Northern California. Former and current NFL players and coaches play in this event to show their respect for a man who played 15 years in the NFL for the Raiders as an offensive lineman and was the executive director of the NFL Players Association for 25 years. I met Gene actually when I was in college at Cal. Uh, you know, he was with the Raiders. He came in the league before I did. But I think what, what, what Gene meant, not only to guys in football, but his whole presence, you know, Gene understood this in life. Uh, we work to make a living, but what you give is to make a life. And Gene Upshaw was always about that. And you think about this cancer and the cancer research building that was named after Gene. Uh, you can't say enough about who he is and, and what he stood for, and that's why I'm here. Not only did this NFL Hall of Famer influence those he played with, Gene Upshaw was also a man who was not afraid to show his compassion for others. He was almost like a father figure to me, and uh, we spent so many intimate moments together, you know, with the NFL Players Association that uh, his passing was, uh, was very, very difficult to take, to be honest with you. And anything I can do to keep his legacy going, uh, his memory around, I'm going to do. Since his retirement in 1981, along with his death in 2008, current and former NFL players have vowed to keep his legacy alive, putting this golf tournament on their bucket list along with one of the biggest sports memorabilia silent auctions in Northern California. It takes place on the eve of this golf tournament at the Ritz-Carlton. When you like somebody and when you respect them um, and you want their names to live on in perpetuity, uh, I think that's why guys show up. Through this memorial charity golf tournament, Gene's spirit and fighting attitude lives on as his death has brought increased awareness to the disease of pancreatic cancer something that took Gene's life. I got to think that he's probably looking down going, something that I've done, something that's happened to me is being turned into a positive. And then hopefully that the things that I've done and, and the people who are coming around and want to donate the money to help, you know, pancreatic cancer research, hopefully it's going to help people and that's all he wants to do.